little bit of reviews. So what we have here today, two of these beauties. If you guys are familiar with it, these are SIGs. We are dealing in a controlled uh, safe environment. We have the SIG X Macro, uh, SIG's newest selection, all the ranging uh, fun. Um, this is mine. This is the P365X. Um, very similar, a lot of differences. Today we're gonna show you a little bit of the, the shooting uh, footage, uh, what it feels like, and we'll talk a little bit about it of uh, whether this is the right fit for you. If you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing. Make sure you click on the notification bell so you can stay up to date when videos like this are released. But enough of that mumbo jumbo, let's get into the shooting. All right, so this is the P365X, like uh, you guys had seen. Um, as we compare it to the macro, there's some similarities, but a lot of differences. One of the big things as far as why I fell with this one is you guys have been um, long enough on the, on the channel. Um, if you haven't, make sure you're subscribed. But if you have, um, I have the regular P365 and I had the XL. So this is a happy medium for it. It's optic cut. Uh, small uh, slide barrel. I think it's three and 3.3. Um, great sights. The one thing that I love about this is that you don't lose the rear sight like you do on the XL. Um, it has the same flat trigger that I liked on the XL. Um, they have a rail. It's not 100% useful like the macro where I did get a TLR7 sub on it, but it has to be the one that's sick. So at least now I don't have to go with a SIG proprietary light, which is great. Um, but the plus that I really liked about it is that it has that XL grip. So in, in order for uh, me to carry a couple more rounds of capacity, um, I felt that this was the need to go. So instead of 10 rounds, I have 12. Uh, they do make the 15 rounds, which fit nice and flush in there. Um, as you guys can see there, I do get a full three fingers on it. I don't need that little extension onto the, to the piece. This is a flat. And you can see my whole hand fits on there. Uh, this does come with a safety. I never use it. Um, like I said, sights are very nice. Uh, SIG is known for its great sights. And the gripping, stippling that it has on there, very nice, solid gun to, to have a purchase on it right there. So, yeah, that is the P365X. With the, with the P365X, one of the great things that I really enjoy about this is really the fact that you have that full purchasing power. Slide is small, sight radius is good, and then paired up with that Holosun, it's a winner. Um, you know, let's keep getting shots down range. Yeah, go ahead. All right, so let's run through some of the, the features of the P365X Macro, uh, some of the things that SIG has done right. A um, couple of things starting from the top here. We still have the forward and rear serrations, which is very nice. If you like to do press checks, that's very good for you there. Uh, that comp, that integrated comp. Uh, barrel still the same length as... The P365X, as you guys can see there, but that integrated comp is now there. 
Uh, for those of you that like running the comp, I do see that it brings the shot down a bit. Uh, so it, co uh, it helps with controlling recoil management. Uh, same flat trigger as the P365XL, so that hasn't changed. Uh, a big plus that I think SIG has been listening to the consumer is actually getting a full-size pick rail. Uh, what does that mean to you? Now you can put different uh, weapons light, not something SIG proprietary. Um, you can put red um, uh, lasers, uh, lights, whatever you like to pair up with that. Um, you don't lose when you put on your optic. You don't lose that rear sight, which is a plus. It has great night sights that SIG is well and known for. And the huge, 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 huge difference, as you guys can see, uh, very similar in size, but a big, big, big difference. So this, this grip right here actually holds 17 rounds. Um, mags like this that pair up with a little bit of extension, you can see that can, can get uh, a lot more rounds for you. So for that micro uh, capacity gun, you're packing a mighty punch for this. The gripping or sippling that you have in here is the same one that, that's been on the other one. Um, you guys can see there, it's very textured. Kind of that sandpaper feel, so it's good enough. Uh, you get a nice, good, solid grip, and you don't have to keep readjusting your, your sight. Uh, beaver tail is nice and high, so you can get a full, solid grip on it. Aside from that, you know, I mean, those, those are the big, big benefits and uh, features that this uh, gun does have, too. Uh, but what... What's the right fit for you? Is it the P365X or the P365X macro? SIG isn't dumb. They make uh, upgrades, they make changes, they listen to the consumer, um, and they give you what you're looking for. Uh, now, does this fit your need or does this one? Uh, you got higher round capacity, you got a, a larger gun, um, you got a full rail that you can actually use here. Same triggers on both, same barrel size. Uh, slide is a little bit uh, smaller. So, you know, weight wise, it's a bit of a difference. Um, concealment wise, kind of similar. Um, so that's something that you that you have to decide. All right, so the big difference would probably be around differentiating the price point. Um, I was able to get this for a very nice deal, right under $600, uh, where this one right now is probably uh, retailing over $800. So. And that's not even including the optic. So those are things that you want to take into consideration and factor in. Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. You guys got to see some of that range time footage. I can share a little bit of what the, the benefits that they kind of share and some of the differences that they don't um, have. Um, I'll say one thing for sure is SIG continues to do very nice by what they're putting out. They're listening to the consumer. Uh, they're giving you great, great selections to choose from. Um, again, if you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing. Click on the notification. Get out there. Go shoot. Stay vigilant. Um, and get the training in. Until next time, see you guys later.